This is Pinion in three, two, one. This is Pinion reporting live from Arrow Hobbies in Louisville, Texas. Above me, the greatness that is Dave Sweat. How are you doing, Dave? Pretty good today. What's up, dog? Well, I understand uh, you called me in for a box opening, and you've informed me that you have a goblin. It's the elusive red goblin. Yes, rare. Just like the Loch Ness Monster. <laughs> yes, but we have a red goblin, in spite of the fact that the box is green. He's assured me that the goblin that's contained it therein is a red goblin. <laughs> so now we're going to do the greatness that is the pinion box opening. The pinion box opening. Okay, Dave, show us what you got, Dave. Let's get in it, yes. man. Let's get Pinion's in excited. it. Pinion's getting pinion wood. Yeah. Right. It ain't no candy pinions. Yes. Okay. Hold the packaging. Yes. It says red right there on it the box. It says red right yes. there. I'm assuming these are the frames. Well, let's don't assume. Let's look. Oh, yes. Okay. All right, let's roll it. That's what we're all about, baby. The box over. Yes. Hey, box. Dougie. We may need some help over here, man. Yes. You can help distribute the parts. Yes. And it is. Truly it red. It's the landing gear. Yes. The tail pieces. Show those to us. Yes. Hey, look. It's red. Hey, look, yeah. it's red. It Very red. nice. Check yeah. that out. I like that lot. Yeah. I'm digging the red so far. It's I like it. It's kind of pink. Yes. Um, these could be the, the rose-colored glasses you wear. Well, that could be okay. Frames look very thick, too. What are that, two, two and a half, three? Uh, two and a half? Yeah, yes. two and a half. Yeah. Nice-looking frames. Nice-looking yes. frames. Nice-looking yeah. frames. Okay, so that's the... One marked red. Yes. We got See, Dougie's epic. distributing the parts down here. We got no, the so. epic instruction manual. Now, here's something now, is that... It, is it in Italian? Uh, yes. Yes, ah. it is in Italian. No, it's not. It's, it's, it's in English. It's in English. Now, here's something I learned about the Goblin that um, is really cool. Each page that you open, basically to start your frame assembly... Has its own box. Yes, and when you open the bag, those screws match that particular section of the instruction manual. Sweet. This yes. is a new concept. A lot yes. of other co helicopter companies should, should you know, yes. take that into effect. Okay, let's see some more parts. Yes, that's a big box. That's got to have a boom or a this is canopy the can. in it. Yeah, it's got to have a canopy in it. Can. Yes. Pinion loves the canopies. Oh, oh look at that. Yes. That's sexy. Uh, so. Yes, it's very nice. Yes. This Goblin 700 on it and everything. Look at this. Yes. Let's get the exact. I don't know what the paint quality in this. Um, Looks very nice. Cano mod, right? Uh, be honest, yes. I'm not sure. Is that it? Yes, it is. I think they do, they do the canopy and then SAB does the boom, if I remember. Yes. We'd like to have the element of danger using the exacto knife. Maybe we can injure ourselves. Okay. Yeah, man, that's this good. goblin on it, everything. Come on, Dave. We're running out of tape. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> packaging. Which I like the packaging. That's the other thing about this kit. Man, I've opened one before. I actually have a green one. Looks like as well. it's in saran wrap to me. Yes. Oh, yes. Look at the finish. Yes. It's shiny. Already have the holes for the uh, canopy, canopy hold down nuts. Yes. 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 Okay. I think that's very nice. You see, it's a mod right there. Yes. Cano mod. Sweet. It's very yeah. nice finish. They did a good job. The The reason I bought the red one, um, the only person I have seen flying one of these is Tarak. Uh, Alcide? Alcide? What is it, Tarak? Yeah. Anyway, we we'll just call him Tarek A. Yeah, yes. Tarek A. He lives no. in the United States of Emirates. Oh, he'll Miami. like hearing that. Yes. Yeah. Okay, so we got that. Put that in the box. Beautiful red canopy. Mm -hmm. What do we have here? You were so stupid. Mm -hmm. Box full of parts. Wow, it's in foam. Yeah, check that out. Yes. The head, the swash plate. The swash. You have the uh, main shaft. <laughs> just talking about shaft. Yeah. <laughs> Very nice, very, very nice. nice packaging. Yes. Very nice packaging. Check that out. It's like museum quality. It is museum quality. Yes. Look. Yes. Pinion's impressed. Oh, look at that. Lots of yeah. metal. Pinion this likes is, metal. This is the main section of the goblin. 
this is the, the, the base mechanics. You can Mitch, see. you're getting that good? Is it showing up good through all the plastic? Oh, yeah. Okay. All right. Look, it's in a Ziploc bag. Let's unlock that baby. Okay. Yes. Unzip it. Yes. Opinion's exciting. It's like the GPS 346. Yeah. Did you ever have one of those? I did. You remember how it was well, packaged? It was packaged like that. Really? It had, only it was the fuzzy stuff. Ah. It was inside the fuzzy. Yeah. It was like uh, Look at that. jewelry. Crown jewels, yeah. Look at that. Very nice finish on these parts. Look yes. at the machining on that. <laughs> there must be some mistake. They must have thought this was for Bert. Because this has really got a nice finish on it. It really does. Yes. It really does. Those Italian boys, man, they know how to make sports cars and RC helicopters, man. Not much on electronics, but they're good at the cars. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yes. yes. We'll just let the truth out. Yeah. We'll just let the truth out. Um, Very nice. This is some gears here. Here's the gears. Yes. And the pulleys. And, and the pulleys. pulleys. Open it up. This is a box open. I think it's got the belts in it too. Yeah. Saw the little motor belts. Vinny yeah. likes lots of belts. Yes. This is all like an outrage on this package. All the foam and the Ziploc bags. Yes. I like the Ziploc bags. Yeah. You know, okay. uh, now we really got problems. We got a little lost exacto knife. Yes, that's what you want floating around. All right, check that out. Yes. Yes. Got some high quality that's stuff. That's a beefy right gear right there, my friend. Very big. Yes. Very nice, very nice. <laughs> and see, here's the belt that uh, Mitch was alluding to. Yes. These are all the other little pieces. Very nice. Look, um, I'm assuming these are the different for the different uh, gear ratio gear ratios yes. that you can do with the tail. It's very nice. Yeah, very cool. The swash looks good. Everything looks nice. It very, does. very good quality. Very well packaged. Yes. Okay. Let's get into this one. Dave, was the Ziploc thing on the end too complicated for you? A little much. Okay. <laughs> it was late, late, late night last night. <clears throat> what were you doing last night, my friend? Uh, working on computer stuff. Yeah. That's how we pay for goblins, is to have to work on Work for the man. Stuff. Yes. Look at that. Very nice. Yes. I like the swash. The swash is very nice. Looks like you can replace uh, the hind ball in it. Maybe replace the bearings. Yes. Take a look at the head. Looks very beefy. Wow. Yeah, it's not going anywhere. That's cool. Yeah. Yes. Now, what do they call this? You guys know more about Mitch. What What is the? D, d, I hear the term DFC. What does that mean? Is direct that a, Direct Flight Control. Okay. Yes. Or direct from company. You don't have to have choice. a separate thing for your washout arms either. Okay. Well, let's get in some other good stuff here. What's in the boxes? I'm excited. The excitement is overwhelming. I need a few box. Yes. That hey. was impressive. Space filler. Right oh, it's there, a space man. filler. Yeah, yeah. it's okay. Is that, yeah. that, is that the technical term, space filler? I think that's what it that Either means. that or that means you didn't pay for the optional parts. Oh. Yes. There's the boom. There is the boom. How did you know? How did he know? The elusive red boom. Very nice. Now, I've heard a rumor that the uh, SAB Goblin, the red, matches the packs. The false packs. Yes. Very nice. Check yes. That out. You gotta like that. That's sexy, Penny. Yes, I like that lot. Yeah. That, 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 that would go well. Yes. What do you think, Mitch? I like it. You digging it? I like it. All right. I like the red more than the green. Oh, look. Rudder SAB blades. blades, yes. Swing. Tail blades. Tail blades, yes. SAB. Wrong one. All right. That's it? That's everything? That's the whole chopper? Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. There's nothing cool in this box left? Nope. Just the blades. Where's the main belt? It. Supposedly you can build this thing in about four hours. Okay, well we'll be back in four hours. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Here's what motor we're gonna put in it. The greatness, the, the Scorpion. This is the, the Scorpion Ultimate. 
4525 520 KV. Yes. So this should be able to crank the hell out of it. Okay, what are you going to use for motivation for the packs? What, what packs are you using? Um, we are going to use matching. Check it out. Pulse packs. 5000s. These are 45C. I'm actually going to put 65C in them. But, yes. But, yeah. The more C's, the better, right? The more C's, the I better. want more C's. Okay, Dave, well, this is pretty interesting. I appreciate you showing us your goblin. Yeah. I uh, understand you're going to do something extra with goblin. We'll do a separate video about that. But, yeah, we can do but, that. Uh, this is uh, very interesting. I hope you have a good time building your red goblin, and we'll do some video when you get finished. We'll have so, Mitch wear, really bring it out for us. Rock on, yeah. man. Rock on, Penny. This is Penny signing off from Air Hobbies in Louisville, Texas. At the yeah. Power Motors. I mean,